Hey guys, I'm Nick. I'm back. I'm not Nicky Star Tip anymore. I was never Nicky Star Tip actually. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a winter or a cold season uh, cupcake. So it's it's perfect for the cold season. This is Charlie scratching himself, by the way. If you can hear that in the background, he's just at my feet. Um, so I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a hot chocolate Nutella brownie cupcake, which is a mouthful, but it is so delicious. It is incredible and you can have these hot or cold but I'm going to show you at the end of the episode what I mean by that. Well let's get stuck into it. These are the ingredients you need to make them. Okay guys so start off by preheating your oven to 160 degrees celsius or 320 degrees fahrenheit. The ingredients you're going to need are some toasted hazelnuts, some mini marshmallows, butter, eggs, chocolate sauce, flour, cocoa powder, lots and lots of Nutella, some cream, I've got two lots of dark chocolate here, and some sugar. And guys, if you're watching this and you haven't subscribed, make sure you hit the subscribe button because I upload two new videos a week for you guys. We're going to start off by popping our chocolate and butter into a large microwave safe bowl. Microwave that for about a minute, cover it with a big plate so that you don't get splatters of butter everywhere and you want to mix that once it's melted. Next you can add your unsweetened cocoa powder and sugar, mix that in as well, followed by your eggs, your Nutella, and your flour. And that's it guys, that is the whole batter. It's so easy. Now we're going to line our cupcake tin with some cupcake liners. Now with this batter, it doesn't actually rise a lot because we haven't mixed it very much or aerated it and it's quite a dense fudgy brownie. So you want to fill these up as much as you can. I'd say almost right up to the top. Then you can pop these into the oven for about 40 minutes and once they're finished baking, transfer them to a cooling rack to cool down completely. Now I'm just adding some Nutella to my chocolate ganache frosting. Recipe for that can be found on my website. And we're going to mix that in until it's well combined. Our cupcakes baked absolutely beautifully and guys I've already tasted these before I'm doing this and they taste phenomenal. We're going to cool the center and fill it up with lots and lots of Nutella followed by a swirl of our chocolate ganache frosting, a drizzle of chocolate sauce on that. We're going to place some hazelnuts and marshmallows on top and guys you can eat this hot by microwaving it or you can have it cold. And that's pretty much it. Okay guys, so those were my Nutella hot chocolate brownie cupcakes. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. I'm super glad to be back. I know some of you are super glad that I'm back, but I know that most of you liked Nikki, so she might be back at some point. I mean, at the moment, she's having a hard time in LA kind of establishing herself. Uh, maybe that has something to do with me tricking her into going to LA. But anyway, if you want the recipe for these cupcakes, you're going to find them on my website, thescrandline.com. Link for that is in the box below. If you enjoyed watching this video, make sure you hit the like button. If you're watching and you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Let's get to 200,000 by the end of the year. My last video is over there for you guys to watch, so click on that for more deliciousness. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I'll see you all on the next episode of The Scrambline. Charlie. Oh, Charlie boy, he found a leaf. Charlie boy. He's grown so much, guys. He's just ridiculous. He's grown so much. He just wants to come up to me. He doesn't want to stay still. I can't get him on screen properly. There he is. So Charlie is four, uh, 13 weeks today and he's grown so much. Charlie, Charlie, and he just loves chewing everything. So um, I'm keeping him busy. I'm playing with him and, um, you know, he sleeps a lot. He poops a lot. He plays a lot and eats a lot. So he's just like a normal puppy. Um, but I wish he could stay this size forever, but he's gonna he's gonna grow into a big dog 
Um, so this is this is what he looks like now. Next time you guys see him, he's going to be even bigger. Um, and I might show you guys some tricks. Now, let me know in the comment section below if you have any questions about Charlie. If you want to know what kind of dog he is, what his favorite toys are, you know, I don't know. Whatever questions you have, I might do a video about Charlie. Okay, bye Charlie. Say bye.